up for Allie! Hello, guys! Es mi pelo, soy tu pela. Hi, hi. Well, let us make it clear. Like the the presentation of Masato is all fake news. <laughs> exactly. The Tokyo is the best best city in the world. So yeah. And well, so I hope you guys already remember my name because it's just three letters. But if you when you have the car accident or something and you suddenly forget my name, there's a really easy way to remember my name. So just place your hands in hit somewhere. Aoi! <laughs> it's totally the same pronunciation. And so, oh, Philip, can I hit your head by my microphone? Oh, no, just your interview. <laughs> no, 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 no. no. Yeah, actually, I'm not the sadist. I'm a masochist, actually. <laughs> yeah, yeah. This is a masochist and sadist. Yeah, and my dog and cat. Well, so um, I'm gonna introduce about my nickname. And oh, yeah, I'm not Chanel. It's not fancy like the Masato. <laughs> so uh, when I was in high school, it is really normal things to call my call the name by mean, mean way. So, for example, my best friend was Stone Beach. And yeah, this is not a real photo. And, <laughs> well, and my boyfriend, <laughs> my boyfriend was a long thing. And I was called walking head. Because my head is like slightly the bigger than my uh, Japanese ovulates. I hope my brain is like better than them. Cause, you know. And but I like the being called by this name because like it reminds me of the Walking Head, Walking sorry, Walking Dead. It's like the spin-off version in the Netflix. Well, and when I was a small, I was a really weird children. Uh, actually, I'm only child, and what kind of the image do you have about the only child? Maybe independent, or like selfish, or greedy, or something. And, well, that everything is true, but I was cold and pessimistic child. So I clearly remember when I was a fall, yeah, this is my real photo. Yeah, I can, you can see it on my face. It's really cold and pessimistic. And yeah, when I was a fall, uh, I was in the kindergarten, and my kindergarten teacher like said to the children, "Oh, everyone, come around me. So whoever the fastest leads to me, you can get a small present. Maybe it's candy. Maybe it's fancy things. So come on, run to me." And like normal children, just run without thinking anything. But I was different. So I was thinking like, yeah, that's no, that not make sense. Cause like the teacher must be prepared for everyone. Cause you know, it's gonna be fair. And like the many students, now many children is mature than me. And like the, they're stronger than me. So I cannot like, run, faster, run faster than them. And like my teacher's game was not for me. So I don't, I decided not to learn. <laughs> so yeah, maybe as you can imagine, I had only few, very few friends. <laughs> and in the time I was kind of really uh, lonely and I need to go, I need to talk to the adult and I, I tend to go to the, my parent, my parents' friends' party, and one day I saw the that my parents' friends had a serious conversation. Uh, that the topic was sexless, but in that time I feel like uh, it's something related to me. So suddenly I, I, oh sorry, <laughs> oh no. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
forget it, forget it. I will talk about it later. And so suddenly I joined that conversation and said, for years me said, yeah, well, yeah, I can feel you. Yeah, actually, I have never been, I have never sex with my boyfriend in my relationship. Because, yeah, you know, because I was just four years old. <laughs> and after that, I asked mom, and mom, what is sex actually? <laughs> and, but now I feel like I need to ask to my mom again after this comedy, because, you know, I, after I take the class of the felicity, sex and sexuality, I, I, it makes me wonder, like, what is sex? <laughs> so, I will do it. And so, yeah, the photo. Okay. So, well, let's uh, move to the next topic. Well, many people maybe experienced about the culture shock, and I did it too. And so, and also, I feel like the I realized that Japanese culture is a little bit weird from European culture, and the first things was the relationship in the public. Maybe as you can imagine. <laughs> well, so when I come to the IPC and I saw the, the Martin and Hira <laughs> was kissing in the common room, I really feel like, am I in the dream? <laughs> or like, am I watching the Hollywood movie or Glee or something? <laughs> But now I realize it is normal things in the European country, maybe like uh, not Japan. And, but like unfortunately, I cannot be the main character in the movie because I don't have boyfriends. <laughs> oh, what, what do you say, Martin? Oh, uh, <laughs> well, yeah, I, t I forgot about it, but. <laughs> Wait, no, no, but Martin, no, 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 sorry. But, you know, like, I don't want to be like Japanese TV drama. I want to be the Hollywood, Hollywood movie, so, well, yeah, no. <laughs> and then, but like, I like watching the people having fun. No, I don't mind like what, watching the people having fun. But like, surprising, surprisingly things was happening in the island. Uh, before I come here, I was traveling in the island, and I went to the Galway, which is a small city in the island. And I was alone, and I spent the night in the hostel dormitory, which was shared by 12 people. No, yeah, 12 people or something. And I went to back to the room, like 12 midnight or something. And but I heard someone chatting. It was, sounds really lovely, and I. I feel like I wanted to be like the friendly Asian, so I almost say like, oh, what's up guys, what are you doing, where are you from? But I realized they're having sex. <laughs> and I, I, I wonder, should I say, can I join? <laughs> but I feel like yeah, it's not today. And also, I don't like their position. No, it's spicy. <laughs> So, well, anyway, so, and also, like, uh, have you guys did it in, in the hostel sex? <laughs> maybe not yet, maybe not yet, yeah, I, I hope so. Um, the, yeah, and also, I was really surprised in the, about the cinema, because in the island, I went to the cinema, and also, I like, I love movies, so I often go to the cinema in Japan, too. But uh, in Japan, we don't show the emotion, even uh, whatever the genre is. Like, for example, well, you know, like, for example, even it's a comedy, in a sad movie, in a scary movie, we don't show the emotion. So I'm gonna role play it. So in Ireland, if we show the sad movie, <laughs> <laughs> it's so sad, like, yeah. <laughs> and the scary movie. <gasps> wow. oh, oh my gosh. And the comedy movie. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not good at doing this, no, nothing. And, well, but in contrast, in Japan, <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
<laughs> you know, because... <laughs> Yeah, because, you know, like, we don't want to, like, disturb anyone, so we don't show the emotion. And I think, like, you know, that every Japanese house some genes of the ninja, so we are really good at hiding <laughs> our emotion. <laughs> and also, the final things I really surprise is that my, about my previous job. Well, my previous job was, re maybe it sounds weird in European country, uh, I was the bartender in the bar, but uh, all of the bartender is young girls, and all of the customer is old men. So they, the customer come to my bar is want to talk with the young girls because they don't know how to talk with the young girls, and they have to pay to enter like thirty euro, and we talk. And actually, there is no nothing more, just talking, the chatting. But they have to pay. So and then and when I was in the bar. In the first day, I need to have the new name because, like you know, I wanted to like hide my my personal my personal information, and I asked my owner to give me the name, and he spent like two hours or something to think my name, and he said to me, "So from now on, you became a I because you are Aoi." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Aoi, I Aoi. No, no. I don't know why, like, you know, like, I'm thinking about the speed, of, speed away. Maybe your Baba is more, much more talented than my owner. Uh, and, yeah. And the first day, one customer came to me, and we were chatting, and he suddenly said, Oh, mm, I know your face. Maybe I saw you in somewhere, didn't we? But, you know, it was fast day. Of course, I don't know him. And I said to him, maybe not, because I don't know you. And this is fast day. Is it misunderstanding, maybe? And the customer said to me, mm, no, you look like a model in that TV show. No, that model was not beautiful, actually. But, you know, it's models. So <laughs> I, was said, I said, thank you very much. And but, like, my customer stringly said, no, but remember, you look like a model, but after the after punch the half face so twenty times. <laughs> and now I realize that what that's why there is the, that kind of bar in Japan, because you know no one wants to talk with him <laughs> without paying. And maybe many people feels like why do why do I work in, why did I working in that kind of bar? Because it sounds really weird and stressful. But there is like many good point. For example, I can earn uh, much money than just just with talk, talking. No, with just talking, I can earn much money like two times more than normal coffee job. For example, and also like can I can be the feminism activist? Because you know, like in Japan, it's so right about the about the gender equality. So it means like the many older men earn much money, too much money than women. So as a one woman. I steal their money from the <laughs> from their wallet, and I'm, I was proud of it. Yeah. And also, it was a good training to talking without thinking thinking another with thinking another things. For example, like one customer said to me, "Oh, I looks like beautiful today," and I answer, "Thank you very much. I'm happy to hear that." But in my head, I was thinking. Oh, his face, his face is, looks like my dog, Shiba dog. Well, did I feed him today? Maybe not. But should I bring him to the hospital? Because he looks really tired in these days. You know, it's really, like, it's really good way to spend the time. And, like, also, but I want to talk, I want to talk about it more, but we don't have time, much time today. So, but if you have question, you can ask me after this comedy show. But please remember, you have to you have to prepare 12 euro, not 20 euro, for asking a question because I was paid in Japan. Thank you.